Hi, this is Paul from TraderThefifth.com and this is my stocks signals video for the Wednesday the 12th of June. So I've been away on vacation, first day back today looking at the markets. And this is one from my swing trading membership that triggered while I was away. Fire and forget daily time frame for FLWS. For the fifth wave, I had, the entry was at 19.08. Now yesterday though, we had a black box breakout signal. So we had increased volume to the upside with a solid green candle there. So that bullish momentum for the first time, you look at our multiple time frame dot cloud down here, is all green as well. So there's some bullish momentum really building in this now. So we're looking good. So what I've done today is I wanted to go through the traditional fifth wave uh, trade if you like has our wave four pullback into our automated probability zones that found support in the amber zone now started to move up i had a sensible entry conservative above 19 dollars and it's in fifth wave target zone is automated in our software around 23 dollars so if you're not in this already then there are opportunities for both a uh, conservative entry strategy and a more aggressive entry strategy. So let's have a look at this now. So remember, I'm already in at 1908, but what I want to do is use the entry for both these today of 1962. This is about our black box entry signal at 1962 in the bubble here. What I'm going to do, the first one is I'm going to put the stop loss just below the way for at 1953, uh, for my, like my original trade. Uh, and then I'm going to put my entry at 1962. And as you can see now, even with this new entry at 1962 and the stop below this wave four pivot, there's still a risk to reward of one to 1 1.6 into our automated target zone there at $23. So it's still not too late to get in on that conservative swing, 1962 entry, $23 target, risk reward, 1 to 1.6. Very, very simple. Now, the next one is a little bit more aggressive. And this one is using our black box breakout strategy. So the stop loss would be 1878. Very tight stop. 1962 is the entry. Remember, we're looking for that momentum for that breakout in this type of strategy. So when we put this on here, we can see that our risk reward is over 1 to 2 before the previous wave three high. So if it does reach the fifth wave target, you're about 400% profit times risk there. So very, very tight stop and entry. Uh, you've got to be managing this uh, very carefully, but there is a great looking um, aggressive trade there for potentially some huge profits there. So let me just remove that. So again, to remind you, I've got this uh, original idea from my traditional fifth wave uh, trading strategy where we've had the wave four pullback um, against the main bullish trend. It's found good support in our probability zones. I've measured the performance of that wave four. So the, our 535 oscillator here has pulled back between 90 and 140% during this wave four, which is perfect. The stochastics crossed over in the oversold zone at the wave four. Everything looks good. We've got a main bullish bias to our uh, to this stock on the daily time frame, and uh, so I got that entry. But now, yesterday, that black box breakout signal really uh, does uh, give me confidence in this current trade that I'm in. Uh, and again, this this order was automatic. I was on way on vacation, uh, but that signal yesterday with that solid green bar. Uh, denoting increased volume and giving us the black box breakout signal at 1962 is where I'm at. So 1962 is the entry, regardless of what you want to do, whether you want a conservative stop down below this previous wave four here, or you want to go aggressive on the stop at 1878. 1962 has got to get through there. That's your entry if you're not in this already. Okay, so that's it for today. Have a great trading day. Speak to you all soon.